top tips brought to you by the current worldwide climate that is racism and not to forget its trusted partners in crime discrimination abuse slavery oppression murder conditioning in fact at this very moment the list is ongoing worldwide so you want to be the perfect black racist well I'ma tell you how you can break into this niche market and be very successful thus earning communal wealth chiching and not to mention hi hey all top tip one you got to be black and proud black and proud now I know when I say this some folk are gonna shudder at the word black and they will also begin to release droplets of perspiration at the word proud which will consume the forehead of that individual but again for the record for top 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 tip number one you got to be black and proud happy to be nappy basically comfortable in one skin top tip two get educated y'all and I am not talking about achieving an expensive piece of paper no I am talking about consciously reading learning seeing and believing also you gotta share the info with other members of your community in fact for those of you who are yet to start practicing black racism why not share these top tips it'll be great to coincide with top tip two it's extremely important that we educate our babies away from the matrix infested school system also just so you mom and dad can have the reassurance that their precious babies minds are not totally destroyed via blatant and subliminal self-hate messages I like to call it psychological warfare protection top tip free when choosing a partner you must have a preference for those who look like you i.e. a black man or a black woman which will result in the rebirth of your community this is one of the most dangerous and disobedient tips I offer to you today so to all you hardcore black racists you may want to practice this one especially top tip four ladies black ladies take pride and fall in love with your appearance which no matter how much you're told to deny it it is a black one okay love that kinky hair and once again be happy to be nappy indulge in that chocolate or caramel or whatever complexion you got indulge in your skin in fact that is a huge huge sin in the society in which we live so practice 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 y'all oh and black man tell that black woman that she is a beauty and not a beast top tip five either only or where possible support blacks in business nothing more racist than wanting to see those who look like you do fantastically especially when there is not enough black business owners about I say secure your borders and keep the invaders out so in closing to all my black racing students you have completed the course congratulations yeah and celebrations yeah go on to be the best black racist you could ever wish to be bye now Okay, man. So, what's good, YouTube, man? I I just really wanna come through real fast with this one right here. And something prompted me to make this video this evening. Okay, and 
I'm not really gonna tell you what, but let me just let me just say this though, and I don't even wanna have to go over this again. I really don't. This is this has to be the last time. First of all, I make no apologies for being black and proud. I make no apologies for being comfortable in my own skin. Although, uh, although at one point I did say this, I'm, and I'm not disrespecting you know white people or any other kind of people, but we are so. Oh my god, we are a rainbow, like, we're just all beautiful in my eyes anyway, we're just different, like, we've all got different, you know, colour complexions, you know, different, you know, different shades, different eye colours, different hair textures, it's beautiful. And I regret that on this day, and I repent. Now, I make no apologies for wanting to support my own, and to see them do well. I love it, I love it when I see a black man or a black woman doing good, and when they help the community, that's, that's good to me don't care about them that do good and then it, they, they, they don't turn back and look back at the rest of us they can fuck off do you know what I'm saying um, I do not and I will not say sorry okay even though a lot of folk will try and make you feel guilty for being into yourself and for loving yourself you know what I'm saying to you for, for simply being in love with self do you know what I'm saying to you but again man I don't make no apologies man um, furthermore you can call me a racist if you so desire that's cool that is cool and I guess according to, to you know according to the society in which we live in today any black person who loves self does love their community do you know what I'm saying you does their love in their community man is an instant top class racist and major danger to the setup which is the system and I, the last thing I really want to say and this goes out to my black people man listen we the conscious community are not the fire starters okay we are not the ones now you got a lot of brothers and sisters up on here giving you some serious knowledge. I'm not one of them. I won't put myself in that category. I do my little thing on the side, but they're they're big in it. Do you know what I'm saying? They're big in the game, yeah. And they're really teaching us some things. And basically, man, you know, they are not the fire starters, nor am I the fire starter. Yeah, I'm just here to kind of put my things out there, my thoughts, my emotions, and my feelings, and my ideas, and my creativity. Okay, to share with you guys, yeah. Now, let me make this very clear to those who are not in the know and who think that we are trouble starters and fire starters let me tell you that the fire has been blazing and burning you for the longest yeah that's why you're hating on we and you're hating on yourself you understand what i'm saying to you now we are only here to put the fire out and turn and and in turn sorry save your self-hating ass because it is a self-hating ass when you hate the fact that we're so proud and we're so black just like you you're black as well whether you like it or not you're black okay but you just don't have the same self-pride okay it frightens you so you attack us okay you attack us and we're only here trying to teach self which is you you are us that's just that's just what it is whether you like it or not you're black okay and um basically like i said the fire has been blazing and burning you for the longest yeah and we are only here to put the fire out and to save you all right now the last thing i want to say to everybody whether you're black you're white or you're asian i don't care all races yeah you heard my my top you know my top five tips or whatever man you know I hope you get what I was saying okay and, I, and this is this is this is the last thing I want to say in closing okay so in closing this is what I want to say this is it I want to even go here again look you call me a racist yeah and I just call myself a product of our and my environment that's all I want to say our is black white asian and all other kind of races and whatever man that's our my is me as an individual black person living in our environment okay the conditions have been set do you know what i'm saying to you and i'm now responding to what was set you may not like it but what have you done what what did you do when you saw the bullshit going on did you do anything any of you have are any uh, are any of you right now doing anything to help the situation or are you enjoying being a sleepwalker don't care if you're black, white, whatever. You must, you must see my point. If you don't, then what can I say, man? You call me racist. I just call myself a product of our and my environment. Okay, see ya. That's what I want to say. Um, again, man, top tips brought to you by the current worldwide climate that is racism. And not to forget, it's trusted partners in crime, discrimination, abuse, slavery, oppression, murder, conditioning. In fact, like I said before, man, at this very moment, the list is ongoing worldwide. So have a good day everybody. Thank you very much. Peace to you.